The question is that Amendment 10716.2 in the name of Miles Briggs, which seeks to amend Motion 10716 in the name of Shirley Ann Somerville on reversal of the UK Government's two child benefit cap, be agreed, and members should cast their votes now. The vote is closed. On a point of order. Point of order, Martin Whitfield. Very grateful, Presiding Officer. I had a very strange intonation from my machine that presented the vote twice, so I voted no twice. I hope it only registers once. Thank you, Mr. Whitfield. I can confirm your vote has been registered. The result of the vote on amendment number 10716.2 in the name of Miles Briggs is yes 28, no 78. There were no abstentions. The amendment is therefore not agreed. The next question is that amendment 10716.1 in the name of Paul O'Kane, which seeks to amend motion 10716 in the name of Shirley Ann Somerville on reversal of the UK Government's two child benefit cap be agreed. Are we all agreed? No. The Parliament is not agreed, therefore we will move to a vote and members should cast their votes now. The vote is closed. I call Pam Duncan Glancy for a point of order. <coughs> I call Pam Duncan Glancy for a point of order. Thank you, Presiding Officer. My app wouldn't refresh. I would have voted yes. Thank you. Ms Duncan Glancy will ensure that is recorded. The result of the vote on amendment number 10716.1 in the name of Paul O'Kane is yes 75, no 28. There were three abstentions. The amendment is therefore agreed. The next question is that motion 10716 in the name of Shirley Ann Somerville as amended on reversal of the UK Government's two child benefit cap be agreed. Are we all agreed? No. The 
Parliament is not agreed. Therefore, we'll move to a vote and members should cast their votes now. The vote is closed. Point of order, Colin Beattie. My app wouldn't uh, refresh. I would have voted yes. Thank you, Mr Beattie. We'll ensure that's recorded. The result of the vote on motion 10716 in the name of Shirley Ann Somerville as amended is yes 78, no 29. There were no abstentions. The motion as amended is therefore agreed. The next question is that motion 10709 in the name of Gillian Martin on legislative consent motion Energy Bill UK legislation be agreed. Are we all agreed? The motion is therefore agreed. And I propose to ask a single question on two parliamentary bureau motions. Does any member object? No member objects. And the question is that motions 10732 on committee meeting times and 10733 on designation of a lead committee in the name of George Adam on behalf of the parliamentary bureau be agreed. Are we all agreed? Yes. The motions are therefore agreed. And that concludes decision time. And in a moment, we will move on to members' business in the name of Edward Mountain.